Alright, well, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War Season 2 with Plus. You gotta kinda add that at the end, because everybody and their mom has literally made a video on the Season 2, and I'm, I don't know. I'm a day late, I know that. I'm never a day late, mind you. The only reason why I was a day late, because like I said in my uh, video I uploaded, I think it was my last video, the job I went into, I already went into it broke, so I didn't have money to get the Battle Pass, and I didn't want to get to you guys with a video talking about the Battle Pass without actually buying it. So I was like, alright, if I'm gonna do this shit, I might as well do it right, right? By the way, Monster. Sponsor Plus. Alright, so they have some outbreak event going on. I'm actually gonna go ahead and play that. They have a nice Tundra. I mean, I take it. I'm trying to collect as much shit as possible. I, I don't know why that's kind of been, like, my goal lately. Just to, like, collect as many, like, sniper skins as possible. But, yeah, we're gonna do that in tomorrow's videos. But today, we're gonna be just talking about the Battle Pass and playing it through. Also, uh, support a critical plus. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, we're gonna go ahead and, uh, buy the Battle Pass. Alright, here we go. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, okay. That's actually pretty cool, I'm not gonna lie. That was actually, <laughs> I like that little animation they did. That was actually pretty cool. Ooh, what's this? This is some type of uh, LMG? I know we got a new weapon. We got the uh, FAR-83. So a lot of people were comparing this to the uh, to the VAL and for the Galil, if I'm not mistaken. But FAR-83 is one of the new weapons and we have, I'm pretty sure we have a new weapon, another new weapon. Yeah, this is it right here. This is the uh, LC-10. It's basically gonna be like, I'm pretty sure once they end up gutting out the MAC-10, this is gonna be the next MAC-10. The MP5 and the MAC-10 have been, are gonna end up getting gutted pretty soon so i'm pretty sure you're gonna see the l10 in every thumbnail possible on youtube then you have your basic skins here like you have your viper skin your uh survivor skin double xp tokens they give you some uh, give you some cod points which you know you gotta appreciate emblems skins for the game uh just going a little further from what i unlock more skins we have some audio tracks uh black ops 2 audio track which that's actually pretty cool another variant for the uh type 63 if i'm not mistaken this is something that they actually advertise the radioactive skin once you get uh, a number amount of kills with it it goes up as you get killed so again something you're gonna see in a lot of people's thumbnails with the max kills with the thumbnail it's just it's it's inevitable i hope they keep doing this and that you know i keep i hope they keep going with the tracers and i hope they keep going with uh adding more radioactive blueprints because that's actually pretty cool that's what black ops was really known for the radioactive camos or at least from when i got introduced to black ops games uh it was you know for the radioactive camos at least with black ops 3 and black ops 4 you know the two games that i was introduced uh first to so yeah this is another skin for the operator and then over here we have the poison dart this is a variant for the lc so that's actually pretty cool i'm not gonna lie i mean i'm not a fan it goes with the whole jungle gimmick they got going on here for this season but i i, I guess i'd run around with it once i unlock it then over here we have an ammo runner which you know you'd use in warzone and then over here we have you know another vehicle so that's actually pretty cool then you get the you know the new emblem now of course park has a new skin right off the bat this is her skin i'm actually probably gonna rock this my boy i i this is my boy, I'm always using him, so he has a new skin, he has a new FBI skin, which is actually pretty cool. This is his new FBI skin, I don't know if I'm feeling it, I mean, you know, since I use him as a main, since he's one of the default characters and I'm steady using him as a main, I guess I'll use his new character. Uh, also, Adler has a new skin over here, he has a little jungle skin, which actually seems really fucking cool. And then over here we have Maxis, she's one of the new zombie characters that a lot of people see with the eyes and shit, she actually looks really cool. Oh, Alright, I wasn't, I scared the shit out of me, I was not expecting that. Naga, okay, I thought his name was Viper. Yeah, we have Naga over here, this is him as the, you know, the default character and shit this is you know him on the, on the cover and shit i mean all right yeah he looks pretty cool I, I guess i'll have him i'm not gonna have that as my favorite but i'll have him when i do go on you know that team the new em so they have four new emblems for this season it is this prestige a emblem with the pilot they have this one with the snake going through the skull with the knife going through the teeth they have this one which again goes along with the the jungle gimmick they have going on for this season and then this is the final prestige one which is just a knife going through the head and it looks like something out of game of thrones honestly probably my favorite one the pilot one it was it's a it's a it's a toss up between that one and last season's with this one with the knife going through the skull but with the roses that's actually a nice finish. 9 times out of 10 when I do hit Master Prestige I mean I'm pretty sure I can get it now. I'm pretty sure I can just yeah set my thing back to it. Either way I'm just gonna end up going back to the same shit that I was using uh, last season. It's the uh, Prestige 4 emblem for uh, Modern Warfare 3. It's the purple emblem. It's my shit. Oh this is an interesting in intro. Okay. All right. I, I actually really do fuck with that. It was way better than the typical, like, coming off of a helicopter or getting out of a car and jumping off like that. I mean, yeah, the map overall looks good. I mean, I'm getting a smooth performance for it. I mean, I don't, not really, no complaints here. I didn't really have much to talk about going into this video, so, I mean, I'm just chilling. I've been wanting to work on my shot a little more since since I've been seeing Stodgy play. He's been making me want to, like, hop on or do this shit more. I have the battle pass I'm more inclined to play, because I was going to play before, but, like, you rank up so fucking slow when you don't have the battle pass. You rank up slow with the battle pass, but imagine with 
how it's so oh my god it's super slow you'll do these high kill games you'll have a high ass level but then you'll have like a low ass battle pass uh streak uh as far as the map i i don't mind it it's different i i don't see myself uh playing i mean i don't know this seems like gonna play if it's like something new being offered but is i don't know it just seems like really really big easy places for people to camp too so it's like i don't i don't really know i don't know i like the aesthetic i like what they're trying to do with it it looks really nice visually this map is really good i'm not gonna lie but it's just i don't know it's too big for me personally this looks like something like dragged out of a zombies map i'm not gonna lie i, I do really do enjoy the uh, aesthetic of everything that this season has to offer like i like that they're keeping up to everything like their theme is the jungle theme and they given it they're literally giving us thousands of camos and thousands of everything in this game that represents jungle and just you know what they advertise in the trailer something so small but yet it adds a lot to the game i'm not really picky when it comes to call of duty games because whether i love it or hate it i'm gonna play the game regardless so i just look at it like that i'm gonna play the game regardless so whether i love it hate it whether i despise the game and wish they did more for the snipers which i still really do supposed to be getting a new sniper this season though so i that's gonna be coming later this season so i'm really excited for that Motherfucker shot me through the floor? You're not serious. Mm-hmm. Yeah! Die machine gameplay. Oh. Who's next? Oh, fuck. I sat here and grinded that for what? A 90 second cooldown now. I really don't care to snipe anymore. That's the only reason why I have this Mac Town with this Pelling Team. Because when I don't feel like sniping, I can just sit here, swap, and just <laughs> do this. The game's really quiet. Like, I thought I was going to hear people talking and shit, people cursing people out for using Mac 10 still. But no, 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 everything's fine. The gold on this Pelling Team is a little weird. I don't know if it's because of the lighting. But, yeah, you see it's how it's, like, a lot darker down there. It's a lot, like, I don't know, more silverish up there. I mean, hey, if this video goes on to 10 minutes, hey, I'm... Thank you for watching it because I know I've been uploading like just nothing but short videos So when I do upload a, a 10 minute video or a 16 minute video It looks a little weird or those weird occasions where I do upload like zombies videos Like it's really weird because it's like 20 minute videos like for those of you guys who actually sit there and watch those videos It means the absolute world to me because I know from watching a youtuber and watching You know four to five minute videos every day and then you go to seeing a 10 minute video and you're like Why the fuck does it feel like he's just dragging it and then you lose interest like, I, I, at least that's what I go through. So anybody else who, like, actually sits here and watches my videos, it, it means the absolute world to me, and I really do appreciate it. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. Make sure you hit the thumbs up button for life and subscribe for more. And, uh, yeah, that'll be it for today's video. Peace.